and welcome back to the channel. On this video, I want to talk about Labor Day week, Labor Day week, uh, yes, uh, 2024 deals that are out there. A few deals that stand out to me. Um, and I'm only going to name a few, but I got to tell you right off the top, there's um, lots of choices out there. Aventon have good deals going on right now. Uh, Aerial Rider, I believe theirs is still running. Uh, Lyric Cycles, I think theirs is still going. But uh, no matter which bike company uh, or which bike you're interested in, check out their websites because chances are they may have a bike that's on sale that you are interested in and um, this is a good time to buy when the bikes come on sale it's the best time to buy so the the few bikes that i want to talk about here the one that stands out to me as the best deal i think of the bunch of the few that i'm going to talk about or of all of them first of all the I think the one that stands out number one would be the Magicycle Cruiser Pro. And that one I want to elaborate a little bit on and give you some of the uh, details on the bike. I'm riding the Ride One Up Cafe Cruiser, by the way, right now. And I'm going to talk a little bit about this one as well uh, a little bit later. But first, let's talk a little bit about the Magicycle. So the Magicycle, you get a choice of the mid-step or the step over. And this bike has some pretty darn good specs on it. Um, so it's got a 52 volt, first of all, which is definitely a thumbs up. I like the 52 volt. It has a 750 watt motor that peaks at 1500 watts. And that's a, that's quite a powerful motor there it also has a hundred newton meters of torque so that's going to be a very a very good uh, thing to have on your side if you are have any hills in your area for climbing uh, that's going to help you quite a bit right there the battery is also a nice size it's a 52 volt 20 amp hour they claim that the range is up to 100 miles I'm not seeing 100 miles in that size of a battery, but that's what they say, so we're going to go with that. I'd say you're looking at more of a, depending on what pedal assist level you use, but if you use not so much pedal assist, then I think maybe more in the 40 mile range, maybe, something like that. And if you're just throttling, you're probably going to be more in the 20, 25 mile. You might get to 30, it depends how hard you throttle. If you're throttling full tilt on the bike, then uh, be less. Uh, speaking of uh, pedal assist levels, this does have seven. Uh, for height of rider, they're saying five foot five to six foot five. It is a 26 by four inch tires on the bike. It is a half twist throttle. The brakes are hydraulic and have a 180 uh, millimeter rotors. So that's the a standard size along with 160 so 180 is the better of the two if you have a choice between 160 and 180 of course you want the 180 so that's a good thing uh, let's see what else can I tell you about that bike it comes in a few different colors um, I will leave a link in the description if you want to go and check out the Magicycle Cruiser Pro. They have other bikes too that are on sale, but this one is the one that stood out to me as their best deal. Uh, so let's mention the price here. 
So this bike is running at $14.99. That's a discount of $900 off the original $23.99. I definitely would be looking around if I was going to be paying the $23.99. But the $14.99, definitely, that is worth it. So something else about this bike that I wanted to mention is that it also comes with some free accessories and you have to check their website for sure to see which accessories. Some of them are free and then some are discounted priced. So if you wanted to get those extra accessories, of course you'll get the free ones and then you can choose whether you want to get the, uh, the other accessories that are uh, discounted in price. So there is free shipping also on the bike and I think I pretty much covered everything I wanted to on the bike and that's the Magicycle Cruiser Pro uh, $14.99 regular $23.99 uh, I would probably pick the mid-step for myself but you have a choice of that one or the step over okay so that would be my number one choice but there's a few other bikes out here that are good deals as well so let's talk next about another good deal that really stands out to me okay so I have owned the Rad Rover 4 before it was my first ever bike it was at the time I bought it which was several years ago now it was running at $1,500 and you had to buy the fenders extra so that was an extra $90 for the fenders and I of course wanted to have fenders so I paid the extra when they came in stock I got them so that bike did me well it's now owned by my friend Keith and he loves the bike as well it's still going strong and but that bike the six the Rad Rover 6 plus version is the one I wanted to talk about here being on sale $9.99 it's a $16.99 bike on sale for $9.99 that's a $700 savings free shipping and of course rad power bikes is a reputable name uh, you know they're one of the longest running e-bike uh, companies I believe around so they have made a good name for themselves and very trusting so you might want to check that one out and the other one that rad has that's a on sale as well for the same price $9.99 regular $15.99 I think is the regular price he's the rad city 5 so you might want to check that one out uh, that one's also running like I said $9.99 I will leave a link in the description and you can go and check that out And like I say, there's other bikes out there that are on sale, Aventon and Himaway and different ones, uh, Aerial Rider. Some of these may be ending, but some of them may be going through the next week. But uh, one more I wanted to talk about, and that's Rad, or not Rad, but Ride One Up, the cafe cruiser that I'm on right now, and I can give testimony to this bike so this bike I've had for about three months now I believe I can't remember it might be more than three months it's been a little bit anyway and I've enjoyed this bike a lot it's um, Depending on which model or color that you want for the bike, this bike is running anywhere from 1049 or 1045 
to $11.95 right now on sale. The regular price is $13.95. They did have this bike up as high as $15.95, so a pretty good deal. And I can definitely tell you this is a fantastic bike. Uh, it's not quite a fat tire bike, but it's almost. The wheels, I think the tires are three inch wide or 2.75, I can't remember. 26 inch. The bike is a class three. Uh, with pedal assist, I have had the bike touching a little over 30 miles per hour, but I was pedaling like mad. But uh, if you just throttle only, it's 20 miles per hour, but it can be unlocked to go 28. And the bike comes in three different colors. And like I say, depending on the color or the frame style that you want, the bike is running anywhere from 1045 to 1195. So it is a 750 watt motor. It's a Bafang motor. The bike is 48 volt, has a 15 amp hour battery. I do not know how far you can go on a charge, but I think you can go a fair ways. I would say probably in the 30 plus mile range because of, uh, depending on the uh, conditions, your, your uh, weight uh, of you, yourself and how much cargo you're pulling. Uh, the bike is smooth as can be. It's a very comfortable, easy bike to ride. It's it's not expensive, so if you're looking for an entry-level bike, you want to get into the electric bike world, this is a really nice bike. It's very nimble, easy to handle. It's not heavy. It weighs 65 pounds. I mean, it looks really classy. I love the look of it. It's got the... Uh, I'm going to go straight here. It's got the... Uh, um, I got a bell on there that I added that does not have a bell, but it does have a tail light and a headlight. It has the swept back handlebars as well that makes that classic look to the bike. It has a front suspension, very comfortable seat. I will get off the bike and show you here in just a second. And the uh, display is simple, easy to read. It's got the uh, battery uh, charge level. It's got the pedal assist level, the speed, and your watts. But you can change that all up depending on what you like. I leave it like this. And the nice thing about this bike, unlike some others, when you t turn the bike off and turn it back on, it remembers the pedal assist level that you were last at. Because some of the bikes automatically go back to one. So I uh, prefer this. Um, but that's the Ride One Up Cafe Cruiser. And like the other bikes, I will leave a link in the description if you want to check it out. And I'm going to hop off here and just let you have a quick look at it. And it does come with this integrated rear rack, the fenders, and these are metal fenders, which is really cool. Um, a lot of the bikes have just the plastic fenders. I prefer the metal. I think they're stronger, you know, they don't, they're not as flimsy as the uh, plastic. And they give the bike a better look, in my opinion. But there's a look at the bike. And here's a look at the handlebars. Like I say, the only thing I've added is the bell. It probably should have a mirror on here, but I don't have one on there at the moment. But that's the Ride One Up Cafe Cruiser. So that's gonna do it for this video. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, just hit the subscribe button. Thank you very much for doing that. And if you wanna be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell.
And if you want to comment on this video or any others, maybe let us know of a deal you know of that's out there and share that with our viewers. That'd be awesome. So once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you later.